Come on now. Let's go. Come on now. Dante! Dante! Grab me on three. One, two, three. Bam. What up, man? Me and Tyler, uh, we met like during like the draft process of coming out of college. Um, I mean, every game we played, we probably switched jerseys. Um, I mean, he's just a very, very, very smart, intelligent guy, man. I mean, and uh, he's definitely a, a very, very good friend to have. Man, Maya mic'd up too. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Yeah. Oh, you already know I'm gonna knock your head off. Between the white lines, I'm like, I'm trying to knock his head off. Like, I mean, I see ball, get ball, hit, whatever I see. I mean, like, I don't really got a favorite of stuff on the field. Like, I mean, even if my brother played up on the other team, like, I mean, he would have to get hit. Talk to him! Talk to him! Talk to him! Yep. I mean, I just kind of study a lot of films, especially of Seattle, because I played them a lot in Green Bay. Like, I know Russell Wilson, I know Pete Carroll. Like, I mean, I just had a very good feel for what they was doing. And it's like, I was actually about to be guarding Tyler Lockett one-on-one, -on -one, and uh, T. Mitchell's about to blitz, because uh, whoever the closest one on that side is supposed to go. And when Tyler motioned over, that, like, lets me know, okay, now it's my time to blitz, and obviously, I got hella excited whenever like I see him motion over because I'm like, like, do I get to finally sack Russell Wilson? Tonto! 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 Stop playing with me, yo! Stop playing with me! So when we say talk to him, like that probably means because the other guy is probably not gonna say nothing back because he don't got much to say. So that's why we be like talk to him. <laughs> hey, that taco was so scared of you, boy. That can't even acknowledge me coming out the edge. I'm like, <laughs> hey, I, I appreciate you guys. <laughs> you got, you got me out here crying. <laughs> be like. We could have easily been like, oh, the ref cheated, this and that, and yada, 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 which, I mean, could easily argue that. But, I mean, at the end of the day, that's not going to change the outcome. That's not going to help us in the future. That's not going to do anything for us. Hey, what y'all boy got left in the tank? A whole Come on. We got fumble. Come on. Come on. Come on. They give the ball. Procise got it. And Olivier oh. Gurley got him. Loose ball. The Browns are on it. Gibberon Lawrence is going to get it. Ooh. Let's go. Guys are starting to learn what we are good at and the things that we aren't, like the calls that are working for us and the calls that are not. And, and like, that's the good thing about the November and December football. Like, guys know each other by then. Like, we know what we're good at. And, like, that's when the good teams show how good they are. You feel me? All about footwork, but I think we'll finish 11 and 5, 12 and 4, maybe. I mean, like, I mean, and that's not even wishful thinking. That's like realistically thinking. Like, I mean, this team could get, could easily get hot and go untouched for the rest of the season. And I mean, we obviously got to put in some work, and we obviously got to keep pushing and keep on gelling. But I feel like the bye week came at a very, very good time, and I feel like. Guys needed it, and uh, we're going to come back prepared and ready to go.